Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are doing extremely fine. My name is Prince and you are watching the Tech Stream. In this video, I am going to show you what's new in the latest update of Oxygen OS 12 release for the OnePlus 8 series. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. So OnePlus recently released an update to the stable Oxygen OS 12 for the OnePlus 8 series and if we go into the about section, you can see that the build number is C.17. The build number for OnePlus 8 and 8 Pro will also be C.17. Also you can see that the Android security patch is still 5th March 2022 and we are currently half past May and still we are getting the March security update. Now moving on to install the update, you need to be on C.11 build and then just download the incremental file. Place it in the internal storage of your device. Install the Android 12 Oxygen OS software update application and all the links to the application will be in the description below. Now open the app, select local upgrade and select the incremental file. It is just going to take 4 to 5 minutes to install. Now moving on, let's run some benchmarks on this build. In Geekbench, the device code 906 in single core and 2757 in multi core. Note that these cores were without the high performance mode. If I turn on the high performance mode, the device scores 913 in single core and 3100 17 in the multi core. The scores have definitely improved from the previous builds and the performance feels just great. Now if you look at the changelog of this build, there are only two changes as this update is a just minor update. The first changelog is regarding the sending and receiving messages and I don't know what this changelog is about as I didn't face any problems previously while sending or receiving messages. And the second changelog is improved system stability. This I'll be able to tell in the complete review video after using it for several days. For now, the build seems fine and no major bugs are to be seen. The charging speeds and heating issues are also completely fine. Now if we talk about BGMI, in BGMI you can select 90 FPS from the settings but as you can see in the FPS meter the device is still capped to 60 FPS and there is no way to enable 90 FPS in Oxygen OS 12 as of now. If you are a gamer either roll back to Oxygen OS 11 or install a custom ROM. So that's all for this video. Comment down if you have any questions or doubts regarding this build. I'll try to answer all of them in the complete review video. Subscribe to the channel for more tech videos. Thank Thank you for watching.